welcome back, my acolytes. I'm Darth Zile, back at you again for more Zile tries. And today we have something that tops. Doesn't top, no. Today we have something that fills the criteria of what it takes to get on this most prestigious of shows. That pr that criteria, of course, being when you look at it and you go, "Why the fuck does that exist?" Cereal milk. Cereal milk makes your milk taste like the milk that's left over after you have a bowl of cereal. We are pleased to introduce to you the original cereal mix mixers. Trademark. Bring in the taste of your very favorite cereals to nutritious milk. That's the that that's the trick right there. That's the secret. You could just have the milk at the bottom of your cereal bowl, or you could have this with nutritious milk because it doesn't. This isn't gonna change. Your milk being nutritious, unlike the cereal. The cereal makes the milk not nutritious, unlike cereal milk. Always the final treat in any good bowl of cereal is the yummy milk left in the bottom. Uh, other flavors include cinnamon crunch, frosted flake, and peanut butter cup and that's what we have today we have peanut butter cup and um i have been stirring this for about 10 minutes and there's floaty shit still going on in it uh i've been setting up been, uh, you know set up the lights give it another stir set up the the recording give it another stir uh, adjust the camera give it another stir and it is still, ooh, hmm, what's that chair? It's still fucking floating in there. Well, it tastes like fake chocolate. And fake peanut butter. And it sure as shit doesn't taste like Reese's Puffs. Because I know what Reese's Puffs taste like. Because I have Reese's Puffs. They're delicious. It tastes like... Bottom shelf bagged cereal. I feel like I've used that analogy before. Bottom shelf cough syrup. Maybe that was it from Moxie. Um, but this tastes like bottom shelf bagged rip-off Reese's Puff cereal. Tastes fake chocolate. It takes it tastes like fake peanut butter. It leaves a bad taste in your mouth. But it does taste like the shitty milk that you would get out of that bargain basement bin bag. Cereal. It does. It does. It does taste like that. I would say, don't get it. But then again, I did just have the cup. It's a whole cup. Um, because where are the instructions again? It does say, 8 ounces, which is 1 cup and a tablespoon of cereal milk. Um, I think I might have put too much because it just kept floating. It would not absorb. Ingredients. Sugar. Cocoa processed with shit. <laughs> I can't read it. I'll... Oh, oh, God. 
god, it's giving me the burpees. Uh, what, basically, would I recommend you will go out and get this? Absolutely. Um, if your favorite breakfast foods is cereal, namely Cinnamon Crunch, Frosted Flake, or Peanut Butter Cup, but not the name brand. You can't get no Cinnamon Toast Crunch. No, you gotta find the bag that just says Cinnamon Crunch. You can't get Frost Frosted Flakes, but you can get Frosted Flake. Singular. One big flake per bag. And then you just... And it just fall, you put it in a plate. Uh, and if you like your milk to taste like shit... Uh, absolutely, go ahead and get this. Um, if you have kids, I, this will do fine, I suppose. Um, I know as a kid, I used to love Frosted Flake cereal. I thought that was great. Uh, and my Cheerios, believe it or not, Cocoa Puffs, all that stuff. I always used to love uh, the, the milk after that. Cocoa Pebbles. That's the best cereal milk. Uh, so, original cereal milk, you make Cocoa Pebble milk. I will try it again, because that shit is delicious. And if you fuck that up, I know you don't know what the fuck you're doing. I'd rather just have myself a small bowl of cereal, and then strain the cereal after it gets all super soggy. Strain the cereal and let all the milk go into my cup. And drink that, because at the very least, it's gotta be cheaper than the- How- how much does this cost? How much did this cost me? Too fucking much!